Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another episode of Tinkercad TV. So let's get cracking. Friends, the goal of every episode of Tinkercad TV is to entertain and inspire. Today's design is pretty epic, so let me show you what we got. Friends, today's designs come from the students of Mrs. Ross Davis's classroom. These are all Rube Goldberg machines. And friends, the coolest thing is now in SimLab. We can even watch them work. So friends, when you first load, the geometry has to become permanent. Then we get to come over here and click play and watch it go. Check out the launcher we have got dominoes going around. Notice I can move the world as I check it out. How cool is that? This ball right here is made of steel. Check it rolling across. Bam! Wait for it. Oh, it makes it and launches the next piece. What a cool view. I can zoom in. We've got one more big trigger coming around. Oh, nice turn of the corner. And one last ball down and around. And one final hit. Boom! That is so awesome. Mason, fabulous work. Friends, I do also remind you that once you're done, you can scrub it back and watch it all happen again. How cool is that? Friends, this design is by Brooklyn, and it is called the WOW, because it spells WOW, button pusher. Friends, I have hit play. It is making my day to see cool things like my slide tutorial. I have also got the awesome domino tutorial that teaches you how to do these loops. Oh my goodness, this is working like a champ. Check it out. There it is. The large ball has got it moving again. Around the corner we go, and here it comes on the awesome wow oh this is going to be tricky how does it get through this crossed area oh that is so close i'm just going to zoom in and give it a gentle nudge with a thrown object and there it goes we have got it going into the w how cool that it goes both ways there and around and here it comes up one last curve and then finally bringing it home oh my gosh bingo we have the button pushed brooklyn that is absolutely awesome don't forget friends after you hit pause you can use the cool scrub to go all the way back and watch it in fast speed change your angles it is so cool to be able to see how this entire project came to life that is awesome friends design number three is created by jada oh my goodness this thing is a beast let me zoom out and show you all the way up to the top holy mackerel i have not seen one this large yet let's switch to sim lab and see how she does all right so that loaded pretty fast let's hit play and watch it all come together there go the balls let's see if we can pan down yeah we've got them on the screen they're gonna trigger those down at the bottom let's zoom in we have impact it is about to enter the tube let's see if i can wrap around and see that transparency will it drop yeah there it goes and you can see this ball from the other side actually triggered it ahead of time how cool is that oops accidentally threw a pig but we have success sorry about the pig awesome project jada that is absolutely epic all right everybody this is reese's wacky machine Let's hit play and check it out. We've got a ball at the bottom and we've got a ball at the top. That tripped absolutely perfect. Check this out. So far, we're doing great up there as well. Down it goes. Oh, that's amazing. And here are the dominoes spinning. And bingo. We knock the knocker. 
and check it out. The final landing. How cool is that? Oh my gosh, Reese. Well done, even a basket at the bottom. Now what's cool is if we hit pause, we can check this out from another angle. Let's see if we can drag this and let's see what happens down here again. So all the way back, you can see that that comes down. That's a knife that cuts the cheese. Oh my goodness. And then finally the ball comes down and that is awesome. What a cool project. All right, everybody, this is The Goal Seeker by Tremaine. Let's hit play and watch this beast go to work. Whoo, that's zippy. And around we go. Oh, the ball is moving. Bingo. And bango. That is awesome. Now the other thing I love is we can back it up and check it out from all kinds of different angles, scrubbing it all the way around to watch it finish the course. Dude, that is fantastic. Friends, just a reminder, if you follow one of my tutorials, like say the awesome F1 car, of course there will be a link up above, and you make something super cool and want to share it with me, it is so simple. Click that button, generate a link, copy that link, and then you can reach out and share it with me. I am HL Mod Tech on Facebook, Instagram, Gmail, and TikTok. You can also find me on Twitter. I am HL Tinkercad. Friends, if that doesn't work for you, don't forget my website, hlmodtech.com. It has the sweet built-in messaging tool. You can click that button, add your question, comment, or share link, and reach me almost instantly. Of course, friends, I do also want to highlight the Tinkercad Community Discord. As you can see, we have more than 600 members, and it is a fantastic place to talk everything Tinkercad. Finally, you'll also find all of the categories of Tinkercad lessons I have, and below that, you'll find my day one lessons that are great if you're just starting to use Tinkercad. Friends, as I wrap up, I just want to say thanks again to Mrs. Ross Davis and her students for these awesome projects. And make sure you stay tuned as part two will be coming out Sunday. Friends, of course, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.